In this video, we're going to have a look at how do we factorise two terms that does not involve factorising a difference of two squares. So to factorise an expression involving two terms, the first step is to look for the highest common factor in both of the terms. Step two is to write both terms in factor form using that highest common factor. Step three is to remove the highest common factor and replace it outside of the bracket. Step four is to write the remaining factors inside the bracket. So you end up with the highest common factor outside the bracket, the remaining factors inside of the bracket. So let's have a look at some examples. In the first example, we're gonna factorize 4x plus 16. So I wanna look for the highest common factor between 4x and 16. Now the highest common factor between 4x and 16 is going to be 4. So the second step is to write both terms in terms of that highest common factor. So 4x is going to equal 4 times x. 16 is going to equal 4 times 4. So the third step is to remove the highest common factor and replace it outside of the brackets. So I'm going to remove the highest common factor and replace it outside of my brackets. And then I'm going to complete my last step, which is to take what is remaining and place it inside of the bracket. So x plus 4. So the factorised version of 4x plus 16 is equal to 4, and then inside my brackets, x plus 4. So in the second example, I want to factorise 8x minus 12x squared. So the first step is to identify the highest common factor. And the highest common factor is going to be 4x. So now the second step is to write both terms in terms of that factor. So 8x is equal to 4x times 2 and 12x squared is equal to 4x times by 3 times by x. So my third step is going to be remove that highest common factor and place it outside of my brackets. So 4x outside of the brackets. And the last step is going to be take what is remaining and write it inside of the brackets. So 2 minus 3x. So the factorised form of 8x minus 12x squared is equal to 4x and then 2 minus 3x. Now note that the sign in the brackets matches the sign in the original expression. So in the last example, I'm going to factorise 3x, x minus 2, plus 2, x minus 2. So my first step is to identify the highest common factor, and the highest common factor is going to be x minus 2. The second step is to write both terms using that highest common factor. So 3x x minus 2 equals x minus 2 times 3x and then 2x minus 2 is equal to x minus 2 times by 2. The third step is to remove the highest common factor and write it outside of the brackets. So that's going to equal x minus 2. And I keep it within the set of brackets when I write it outside. And then my last step is to take what is left. So 3x and 2 and write it inside of the bracket. So 3x plus 2. Noting that the sign from the original expression carries forward into my set of brackets. So the factorised form of the expression 3x, x minus 2, plus 2, x minus 2, is equal to x minus 2, 3x plus 2. So there are three examples of how do we factorise 
an expression involving two terms that we cannot make a difference of two squares.